Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for May 10th of 2023. Well, it is titled Milky Way over Egyptian desert. So what do we see here? Well, this is an image of our Milky Way. And as we see here in the foreground, the deserts of Egypt, and in fact, very specific, the white desert of Egypt. And up above in the sky, we see a portion of our own Milky Way galaxy. And that is our galaxy as we see it from within. Now certainly a desert area with a very little light is going to be a great way to be able to see things in the sky. Many areas with high populations are very light polluted and it's difficult to see details in things. Now of course were you standing in this desert you would not see anything like this. Our eyes don't pick up all that detail. They only gather light for a fraction of a second at a time and give us an image. We're Whereas when we use a camera, we can take images over longer periods of time to bring out fine detail in the image. And that's what was done here. In fact, over three nights in March, images were taken, same camera, all from the same location to get this specific image. And then you digitally put those together to bring out the most detail you possibly can. This is often how astronomers will do images. Sometimes you can only observe for so much time at one night. And you may need fainter, uh, you may need observing fainter objects, you need longer and longer exposures. So they will do the same kind of thing as is done here. Now we see the dark dust clouds within the Milky Way, as well as the bright star clouds. You can see how many stars that you can now begin to pick up when you look toward the plane of our Milky Way galaxy. Now our Milky Way is a spiral galaxy. We don't see the spiral structure because we're stuck inside it, but we do see that it is flattened. And that's how we see the Milky Way as a path going across the sky. That is the disk of the Milky Way galaxy where the vast majority of the stars, gas and dust are all located. Within it, we can see some nebulae and let's just label those here for you. At least one of them, the Rho Ophiuchi star clouds off to the right hand side. And we labeled the Milky Way galaxy, but we can see some of the glow that pink glow due to hydrogen gas that is present in all of these nebulae. So that is showing young star formation, as well as some of the blue colors of reflection nebulae of dust around hot stars. So within that Milky Way and within the star, star clouds of Rho Ophiuchi, a lot of stars are in the currently in the process of forming. So that is very common in spiral galaxies such as our own. And in fact, everything you see here is part of our own galaxy. And if you travel out to the desert and can deserts of Egypt here and can take some very long exposures, you're able to see images like this, where we can see great detail in the Milky Way galaxy. So that was our picture of the day for May 10th of 2023. It was titled Milky Way over Egyptian desert. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day, everyone. And I will see you in class.